Welcome to another toothbrush talk. Today is December 4th. Uh, if you don't have your toothbrush with you just yet, head on over there, head to the bathroom, grab it out, put some toothpaste on it, and let's get started. The first candle we light this Advent season is a candle of hope. Who better demonstrates hope than the wise men. For my studies, the wise men, they were modern day astronomers. They studied the stars. There are questions out there surrounding how many wise men really were there. Because scripture only doesn't really mention how many, besides the fact that there were three present. And that is where we get the number three. But either way, these wise men spent their whole lives studying the stars in hope of the star of the Mess Messiah to appear. I want you to think about the build up to Christmas, the Christmas spirit, the Christmas holiday, where you're making lists for your parents, making gingerbread houses, going shopping, putting up your Christmas tree. Many of you may be counting down the days already through your chocolate calendars, but what is that feeling like? Is that excitement, anticipation? Now think about the feeling the wise men had when they first found a new star in the sky that was prophesied to be the news of the Messiah. They would have been overwhelmed with excitement. At first sight of the star, the wise men spent approximately two years in search of this Messiah. So all those nativity scenes out there with the wise men at them, that's fake news, y'all. <laughs> the hope the wise men had in this so-called Messiah was worth traveling over two years in search of. Fortunately for us, we have now been given the hope of a day with Christ. Through the life, death, resurrection of Christ, we can have the hope, we can have hope in eternal life with God. This Advent season, let's get excited to celebrate the birth of our Savior. Where do you find you're putting your hope these days? In school, in sports, or is it in Jesus? I want you guys to think about that this week. Oh, well, this week, today. Think about that today. We're doing this daily. All right, let me say that again. I want you guys to think today about where you are placing your hope. Are you placing it in school? Are you placing it in sports? Are you placing it in our Savior, Jesus Christ, the one we get to celebrate this Advent season?